Hey y'all, it's Janine, back with another tale. Listen, today I'm explaining service lines. A service line is a connection that runs from your house to the meter and connects from the meter to the street. And that's the part that the city maintains. The part that's at the meter to the house is the part that belongs to you. Now you ask yourself now, if this breaks, can I open a claim with my insurance company to have it fixed? Well, you could if you like, because you can open a claim for anything you want. But let me tell you this. You may want to think twice because your homeowner's policy is for damages in your home. They're within anything that happens inside. It does not cover anything buried underground that leads from your house to the city. Now you could call the city out. The city's going to come out and say to you, well, that's not our problem. It's just not our problem. You're going to have to get that fixed. And once you get it fixed, call us and we'll come back and we'll check it out to see if your line is clear. Now, what you can do is some companies, they will give you a small policy to cover your service line. Because if that service line breaks, it's going to cost you at least two, three thousand, four thousand dollars to get fixed. That's a lot of money. But your insurance policy, most companies do not cover service lines because it's not a part of coverage A, your home, coverage B, a fence or a shed, or coverage C, your stuff inside the house. Or D, a simple slip and fall. Service lines crack for a lot of things. Maybe the line is old, you got an older home, or you got roots and things growing in it. It can't be helped, but they do fail. So that's why you have to make provisions. Save your money so you can get those service lines taken care of. But putting in a claim is not going to do you any good because it is possibly not covered. And now you got a claim on your policy that didn't need to be. The best thing to do is you get your coins together and you call someone out and try to fix it. Now, all tips are not good tips, but I'm here to bring the tips. And what I need y'all to do is go ahead and hit that subscribe button because it's better to have the tips and not need them than to need them and not have. And I'll talk to you next time.